Hello everyone, I am S2Jet, and welcome to more Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. In the last episode, we beat um, this, the Woodfall, yeah, Woodfall Dungeon Temple, and got a new song. In this episode, we're kidnapping the princess, ha ha ha. No, I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, no time, blah blah blah. You know what, you're going to wait, because I'm going to do something real quick. Okay, so let me just go ahead and put the offering up here and then back here. So I'm going to I'm going to warp back here so I can return the fairy pieces thingies. No. We. And the moon staring out is really creepy like. Alright, so let's just jump up here. We And let's just come over this way. Uh there's treasures over there, but I'm pretty sure that's just rupees. Nothing important. And here's the fairies fountain with the awesome music. Here's your 15 fairies back. Can I have some magic now? I've been a good boy, I promise. I promise. Fail at speaking. Actually, you need the power to speak better. Oh, strong young one. I am the great fairy of power. And eh, close enough. Thank you for returning my broken and shattered body to normal. As thanks, I grant you prowess with this new sword technique. Wait, whoa, whoa. Mm, tired. And what she does is BAM! Now we got the more spin attack. Uh if you notice like an episode two ago, um Come see me wait, wait whatever. Uh, if you notice in episode 2 ago, when I tried to spin attack, uh, I didn't do it fully like in Ocarina Time. No, in this game, one of the things is that. So now we have cool spin attack. And if you rotate the control stick, um, which won't work for, me for some reason, uh, you can do it without having to charge up. But whatever. Okay, so let's just head back to the palace. And I'm probably not going to cut much in this let's play. I mean, towards the end of the game, yeah, we'll kind of have to, but for right now, I don't really see any point in it. Plus, the palace isn't that far from here. Um, we can kind of do uh, the gold sculptal house right now, but we actually need like one. No, come on, Link. But we need well, one more thing. Um, like after the next dungeon in order to do it, so I'm going to wait till then. So let's just don the Deku disguise. And we get to hear the music one more time. Oh, shut up, sign. Whoa! Oh, hot, hot! Stop it, please! They keep saying that I cannot hurt. No matter how many times I say it, it's not gonna bring the princess back. Ooh, they actually dunked him. Oh, it doesn't seem to work there. Hey King, I got a present for you. I just look, he's dancing. Hey, 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 hey. Hey King, I got a present for you. Oh, my princess, my darling princess, you are alright. I was so worried. You have foolish father. 
<laughs> and I like that um but he's like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh And one has his eyes closed. What are you doing? Let that monkey go this instant. Oh <laughs> the butler's funny. See the monkey's fine. Oh Mr. Monkey, I am ter I am truly sorry. Father does some rash things when he's worried about me. I understand, Princess. Forget about it. Has the temple returned to normal? Why, yes, thanks to Mr. Link here. I am fairly truly grateful. I can't even read that word right. Really? So you're called Link, are you? Thank you for keeping your promise to me. As a symbol of our gratitude, our butler has prepared a little something for you. Please accept it. You'll find it in the shrine that will be to your right when you leave the palace. Alright, so the butler is not here, and we can actually take the Deku mask off. And what do you say? Hey, so you're making this my weakness. This time, more than ever, has become clear to me. Oh, strange traveler, there is little I can do. Please rest a bit before going. I'm gonna put the Deku mask back on. Because well, I can. That and I want to be able to get over to the thing a lot quickly. Yeah, we can come and go at any time now. Unless we reset time. Whoa. We. No, shut up. We. Ah, oh, that's retarded. I clearly made that. No! You know, it might be, just be easier for me to swim. But I'm already almost there! Wee! Wee! Okay, so, we are almost there. Wee! And we're there. Let me just return back to normal. And this looks like he's about to do something inappropriate to me. Like, I am truly grateful for what you have done for the princess. As a sign of our gratitude, we Deku have prepared something that will that we think may assist you. I will lead you to it. I am Mary Poppins. Please follow me. Okay, so this is just like an awkward of time to race against Dampy. Um, basically, the mad shrubs and here will just kind of guide you. We like if you see mad shrubs, you m might know that you're going the right way. Uh, which way do you go? Oh, cool! I went the right way. Uh, I kind of hate this place because I get messed up here a lot. Okay, he went this way. We. I don't remember Mastro's being in here. Oh, he probably takes a different path on day one, two, and three. I don't know. We. Dun dun. By the way, that sound you hear. Oh, which way you go? Okay. Um, that's actually a door closing that prevents you from going uh, back. Now this room can be kind of difficult. Oh. Whew. Okay, so... He went this way. Oh, like, there's only really one point where you hear, like, where you get to, to like, a five-point area. It's not right here. Um, like basically your way around is if you hear redeads, you're going the wrong way. Yes, redeads are in this game. Oh my god, they're like in every single Zelda game. Uh, are we going up to that room? I saw him take a right. So we just climb up these stairs. 
And it's actually very hard to see the stairs. I'm not gonna lie. He went this way. Ooh, what was that? Okay, he went this way. Yeah, I would be out of arrows. Who we got? Okay, come on, Link, catch up. Did he go this way? I think it just loops around. Okay, there we go. I got it. Let me just go ahead and cheese my sword. Now you can see the door's closing. No, I want freedom! Dang it. All these master are just staring. Well done, Link. Now, here's the item I promised. Please accept it. And here we go. This is the Mask of Sense. Uh, it's not really useful. Um, I mean, later on, if you want to finally mush something, it's pretty helpful. But whatever. Actually, when I see you, I remind of my son who left home long ago. Somehow, I feel as if I am once again racing my son. I am afraid I may have tried too hard to outrun you. As old as I am, I am still a fast competitor. Just like when I raced my son. Please forgive my rudeness. No, don't worry. You're fine. Now, um... Funny thing is, if you remember that, um... The, um, tree we saw in episode one, um, that's actually the butler's son, the, um, cool kid, uh, cursed him and made him a tree. Uh, you'll see in the credits that he's, that the butler is actually grieving over the, um, tree. That's not a spoiler, uh, it would have been if I said it any other time, but it's not now. So we're actually, uh, we got a few minutes. Uh, so I'm, I'm gonna head back to Clock Town. Cause there's nothing else really to do now, so... Yeah, I'm gonna head back to Clock Town. And what I'm going to do real quick is, um... I'm just going to say I'm quit. Um... So, next time on Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, uh, we will go get uh, some pieces of heart, uh, uh, like one or two era upgrades, and probably head off to the next area, which will be the Northern Mountain. So, see y'all next time.